Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your Royal Caribbean suite experts, and I am so incredibly excited today to share with you something long in the making. My very first time at Coco Cay was way back in 1991. Nothing like this was even dreamed of at that point. But once again, this is something I'm so excited about. I'm gonna show you the floating overwater bungalows here at Coco Beach Club. What they've said is they're trying to bring a little bit of Bora Bora here to Coco Cay, and I think that they absolutely nailed it. First and foremost, this is a massive space for a bungalow. I, like, I'll just walk across here for a second to give you a little bit of context, but it's absolutely huge. The very first thing that I see is this super comfy couch with a chaise here. This looks like a little dad nap spot for me personally. I know I'll be there shortly. Really, really comfortable and everything in here is ultra luxurious. Even the towels are super fluffy and really, really nice. Here you have your coffee table. It actually doubles as a safe. I think that's absolutely brilliant. So right here, you've got your punch code. You create your own code. You can put your personal belongings in there to lock them away completely. And then you also have these two chairs that are almost like mini day beds and another table right here. I'm gonna take you over to the side because you have your own wet bar. You also have, come around the corner here for one second. You also have this fantastic piece of technology here. It's covered up right now, um, but what you have in there is a screen. What the screen's gonna do is it's gonna allow you to select your own music. You can uh, call your cabin, cabana steward so that you can order food. Basically, anything that you need is on demand for this particular space. You pay a pretty good price for it, but I think actually the value is really, really incredible. But once again, this opened just a couple weeks ago. You have the top technology in any single cabana in the entire industry. In addition to the phenomenal food options, and you know, just for example, you can get surf and turf, you also have continental breakfast here in the morning, but they have a huge, highly upgraded menu that is basically the equivalent to a specialty dining restaurant on, on the ship. You also have your mini fridge down here, it's all stocked. If you have a beverage package on, on uh, the ship, it's gonna work here as well, but there are some upgraded items or specialty items that may not be. If you don't have it, you can also order a la carte, totally up to you. Then I wanted to show you this really, really cool space. So because you're floating on the water, it's a really nice amenity to actually have your own shower. So if you look over here, you just pull down right there, you've got this rainforest shower head. You see down there, you, you hose off. So if, you have, if your kids are in the beach and you have the sand, or if you hop in the ocean and you have a little salt on you, that's fantastic. You also have a little bench here so you can sit and get ready. And there's always gonna be snorkel gear. Snorkel gear is complimentary and included with all of the cabanas here at Coco Beach. For those of you who are curious about it, we do have two US plugs there and two there. If you are traveling and you have European appliances, maybe you wanna bring a European converter. I usually do that, but it would work here as well. And then you notice they have an umbrella because the walk out here is exposed to the elements. Once again, I think you're here to get in the water, enjoy the fun in the sun. So I don't think that's gonna matter one bit. So I have an incredible breeze right now. In fact, it feels really good and I wish I could just stay here and camp out, but definitely wanna show you the entire island today. But right here, you have a fan. Once again, keeps the air moving, makes a huge difference. That matters more when you shut all the curtains because you can shut the curtains on three sides and have a ton of privacy because you're looking directly out to the ocean. See the other set of curtains over here? And they do have lights here as well. Some of the ships are having later and later stays, which I think is phenomenal, but uh, just something I wanted to point out. And there you go. The absolute coolest part, especially for the kids, is you have your own slide. This is similar to like the Palafitos that they have just off the coast of Mexico, and then of course the floating overwater bungalows elsewhere in the world. But having this slide for kids to just go out, I know my daughter would probably go on it a few thousand times. Good for everybody. And the other thing with that I wanted to point out is I do see a lifeguard there, I see a lifeguard over there, and then there is lifeguards throughout. And even out in the uh, the water there, they have a gentleman on a sea dew, a lifeguard out there, and he's got an umbrella. Please, please, please always pay attention. The kids should always have their life jackets on. They are complimentary. They're on the beach. They also have them at the Cocoa Beach Club. But it's just nice that they've added those extra safety measures. I'm gonna continue along here. You've got four beach chairs and you can see the view looking directly at me. I mean, it's perfect. It's looking out at the ocean, this beautiful crystal clear water today. And then I wanted to point out this table slash ice bucket. So it'll be, it's, it is filled with ice and water. That's complimentary. And they're always going to have that here. And then the, it functions as a table as well. You notice you have one umbrella here. You have another umbrella that is shading your dining room table. Once again, all you have to do is call. They're gonna bring you whatever you want here, a huge expanded delicious menu so you can have your lunch here and relax. One thing I did wanna point out, just to be you know, full disclosure to everybody, is you know, it's moving a little bit. I love it, it feels perfect for me, but if you're somebody who's ultra prone to, to seasickness, you may wanna consider one of the land-based cabanas, but to me that just enhances the experience. 
One more thing that I'm super excited about, I love going on catamarans. That's one of my favorite things in the entire world to go sailing on a catamaran. You have this beautiful uh, catamaran net here so you can sit down, lay down, look out at the ocean. I mean, I don't think it gets any better than this, any destination in the entire world. This is phenomenal. To partner it with a cruise, I don't know. I, I know I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm super excited, but this is something that I didn't even know a cruise line could do and Royal Caribbean hit it out of the park. Please make sure that you subscribe to our channel, like this video, and hit the bell for notifications. It makes all the difference in the world for us so that we can continue to share all of these incredible cruise destinations and ships around the world.